Hi and welcome back to Computer Science for Everyone. In this lecture we're going to talk about how to delete nodes from a binary tree. So far we've seen how to create a binary tree, add and find nodes. Deleting nodes takes a bit more work, but first let's remind ourselves how binary trees actually work. So we have a node that can point to two nodes, a right child whose key is greater than the parent's key and a left child whose key is smaller. We can have a root node here and then larger nodes go to the right, like so. 17 is the right node of 15 and 20 is the right node of 17. 10 is the left node of 15 and it has two nodes, 13 and 8, at each side. So how could we delete a node? There is a problem when deleting nodes. That nodes can have children. They can have two children, one child or no children. So what do we do with the children if we delete the node? First of all, let's look at the simplest of these options, which is how to delete a node that has no children. For example, here we want to delete node 9. We simply make node 8, right child, which is 9, point to null, and then Java erases node 9. So just as we saw when deleting items from our list, we simply make it point to null, and then node 9 disappears, and Java takes care of it. So this is a fairly simple option that is just like deleting an item of a list. So how to delete a node with one child? Let's say we want to delete node 8. Node 8's parent is node 10, and node 10 has a left child, which is node 8. So if we make node 10's left child point to node 9, which is the only child, then Java erases node 8 from memory and 10 now points to 9. So this is how that would be done. And finally, deleting a node with two children. This is the more complicated of the options. Let's say we want to delete node 10. We have two choices. In one of them, we make the rightmost element of the left subtree, which in this case is 9, we swap it with node 10. So 10 disappears, and instead we put node 9 there. Node 8 points to null, and now 15 points to 9, 9 points to 8 and 13, like so. Sorry, I forgot the 8, but it should still be there. The other option is if we want to delete node 10, we have again two choices. The other choice is to swap 10 for the leftmost element on the right subtree, essentially putting 13 in place of 10, like so. 15 now points to 13 and 13 points to 8, instead of 15 pointing to 10 and 10 to 8. Remember, it is the rightmost element of the left subtree or the leftmost element in the right subtree. So either the rightmost element in the left subtree, this is the one that is furthest at the right, or the leftmost element in the right subtree, which in our case was 13. In the next video, we're going to look at how to program this. It takes a bit more work than what we've done so far, but together we can get through it and understand everything that is to do with deleting nodes of a binary tree. So stick with me, and let's go into the next one.